Hello, today I welcome you to my world of watches and in this video I'm yet again going to share my initial impressions about a very special timepiece that my friend lent me. So in this video we are going to take a brief look at this Orient Cano. I believe they released this one over a year ago and back then it had a lot of different names but Orient named it Kano which translated from Japanese actually means girlfriend which is kind of a weird name for a watch but it sounds cool. Anyway, it's a slightly bigger watch again, comes in at 44mm in diameter, same as the Casio Duro that I've just reviewed, here's how it looks compared to it. Also it's quite heavy, you can definitely feel it on your wrist. Sized up for me, it weighs around 166 grams, but again, it looks rather nice on my 7 inch wrist as you can see. The bracelet is also extremely comfortable, which I was actually surprised by. Oftentimes these sub $300 watches that come from well-known brands like Seiko, Orient, Citizen and such have great craftsmanship in the whole build quality but the bracelet gets left behind and then you're left with a great timepiece on a crappy rattly bracelet that needs to be changed right away. On this one it's not the case. You get hollow end links, solid links and quite a decent clasp. It opens and closes easily. The wearing experience for the past couple of days was very good. This is a very pleasant watch to wear and it's going to be hard uh, giving this watch back. The overall presence of this watch is just outstanding. I have already got some compliments from my friends. This variation is the only one that has a color dial. The other two colors have black dial and either a black or a red bezel. This one has a blue sunburst dial and a blue bezel. The sunburst is done well. You get different shades of blue in different lighting. Also, the printing on the dial is near perfect, I couldn't find any imperfections here. I like the hand choice, in my opinion, and it goes very well with the indices. For the asking price, which is about $220-$250 at the time of this video, this watch looks way more luxurious. I think it should cost closer to $500. Also, the sound of this bezel is just music to my ears. I thought that my Casio Duro had a great sounding bezel, but this one is just perfect. I don't want to go into full details about this Orient Cano as I need to wear it for a bit longer. I will make a full review video in the near future, I'm not sure when as I have to give this watch back but I will. This is just an extraordinary timepiece that I would love to own myself. Sadly it's not in my budget right now but I'm in love and I hope that I can get my hands on one in the near future. So yeah, if you have any sort of questions or suggestions please leave them in the comments down below. And if you like my video, please leave a like and also consider subscribing and hitting that little bell so you'll get notified when I upload a new video. And now thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.